Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to upload your website on Google for free in 2023. So making your website, of course, more visible. Uh, if you want to do that, you will have to go and upload it into Google or get it on Google for free. If you are eager, of course, to improve your site's visibility and attract more visitors, so stick around and let's explore the step-by-step -step process of uploading your website to Google. So make sure to stick by and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we will have to go open whatever browser we're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm going to use like Brave Browser and of course in your case, could be any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, uh, let's take a moment of course to understand what Google like Search Console is. So Google Search Console is a powerful tool that helps website owners monitor and maintain and even troubleshoot their site's presence in Google search results. Understanding this tool is the key to get your site listed. If you don't have one already, you can simply go and sign up for a Google account, first of all, or if you have one, just go and log into it. And this will give you access to various Google services, including the Search Console. So you can go to the Seattle section, simply type Google Search Console and hit the Enter button. Once you do so, make sure to click on this first link, which is Google Search Console, or you can type simply search.google.com, as you can see as provided here. So just go and enter that. And as you can see, improve your performance on Google Search. Search Google uh, Search Console tools and reports help you measure your site's search traffic and performance, fix issues, and make sure your site shine in Google Search results. So basically, you'll be able to optimize your content with search analytics, see which queries bring users to your site, analyze your site's impression, clicks, and position on Google search. You can get your content on Google, so submit sites map and individual URLs for crawling, review your index coverage to make sure that Google has the freshest view of your site. You can even get alerted on issues and fix your site. So you'll be able to receive email alerts when Google identifies issues on your site. You can see which URLs are affected by these issues and tell Google when you're fixed them or when you fix them. And of course, basically, you will have to understand how Google search sees your page. So the URL uh, inspection tool provides details, scroll, index, and serving information about your page directly from the Google index. So simply, if you want to like start using it, click on start now at the top right corner in here. So just go and click on that. And this will take you in here. So welcome to Google Search Console. To start, select property type. Do you have a domain? All URLs across subdomains like m. etc. All URLs across HTTPS or HTTP and the requires DNS verification. And URL prefix is example, only URLs and their entered address, only URLs and their specific protocol, and allow multiple verification methods. So choose whatever you have. If you already started, simply get just finish the verification. So for me, here I'll just go and enter as example uh, the domain name that I know. I don't know if it's still working or not. So let's just check for verification. So you will have to verify the domain ownership via DNS record. You'll have to select the record type. T -A -A txt which is text recommended or you can even choose the c name so choose whatever suits you then you'll have to go and sign in so after uh, that you'll have to sign in into your domain domain name provider like godaddy namecheap whatever you have this domain name on and copy the c name record below into your dns configuration for this domain name then simply enter that out and please verify below so notes dns uh, changes make uh, may take some time to apply and search console doesn't find the record immediately so wait a day and then try to verify again so I'll just go here and click on verify later so i don't do that now for you of course as we said you will have to go and change your dns and then you you'll have to wait a day until the changes are made then click on continue then and make sure to simply go and click on verify those out for the txt of course changes you'll have to simply 
copy the txt record below into the dns configuration for this domain so copy that and enter it on in there and click on verify below so as example i'll just show you how i'll just go to godaddy.com because for me i have that domain in there click on login to login into my account go to domain names or simply i'll go here to my account and i'll go to my products and let's see so okay i am even like wrong it's without the zero one I should not add zero one so remove remove should be like this without the zero one click on continue and check in verification so as you can see here you'll have to go and click on start verification so because they even like understand that's it's from godaddy so they didn't even ask me to do anything basically i'll just verify that's out so i'll just go here and click on connect to connect it to google and i guess that will be cool so yeah as you can see it's verifying this may take a minute so they will verify everything and basically once you verify like your website you can generate of course a sitemap or for your website using sitemap map generator tool or your website builder built and feature and make sure to submit this sitemap on google or to google search console and of course you'll be able even to use the url inspector or inspection tool in google search console to request indexing for your website pages so this ensures like google crawler, uh, crawlers uh, can discover and index your site's content make sure to even explore the various features in google search console to monitor your site's performance and search results so keep an eye on impressions clicks and other valuable metrics so for me they're telling me here that ownership verification failed of course so domain name provider like the the reason of course is could not find your site please check that you provided the correct url it seems like they have a problem so for me i'll not go and do that again for you just go and verify it and keep doing the steps that i'm telling you so you'll be able after that of course to monitor your performance you'll be able to explore as we said the various features on google console to monitor your site's performance and search results and keep an eye on impressions clicks and other valuable metrics and finally you'll be able to utilize the search console features you'll be able to experiment with other features within the google search console such as performance reports uh, mobile usability and security issues to enhance your site presence and i guess that's it so for you you'll be uh, congratulations because you'll be already uploaded everything on google and use it to improve visibility and a lot of things. So uploading your website to Google using your or using the search uh, console is a vital step in improving its visibility. So thank you for joining me today. And uh, here, of course, to best search visibility and more traffic to your website. And I'll catch you in the next video.